Dear Diary, Today is February 13, 2023 and I just wanted to share my story. I am Carl Bono A. Santiago, 21 years of age, currently studying at Polytechnic University of the Philippines. For today's diary, we are going to apply different communication theories and apply it to my own life experiences. The struggle was so real because I am an only child. My mom almost worked day and night just for us to have sustenance in our everyday life. Since then, I've been guided by my own uncle through my studies, co-curricular activities, and even my own life. Both of them have set low expectations in terms of my academics. In fact, we have this family code that we always follow, supportahan taka, which means supporting each other through ups and downs, through failures and success. That is why my family and I have preconceived thoughts whenever we have our own expectations. With that said, we could actually use expectancy violation theory where Burgo noted that positive and negative attributions of our expectations could either make or break its potential reward. But even if expectations were low, I would still make my mom proud. It was actually during junior high school when I took my academics too seriously. I saw the majority of my classmates earning their own rewards and making their parents proud. With that said, my preconceptions about medals, certificates, and trophies changed after senior high school. I strive to work hard to make both of my uncle and mom proud. In fact, these are the things that kept me going. These are the symbol of my own success and even to suffice the sacrifice that my mom worked hard for. Following three concepts of symbolic interactionism, which are meaning, language, and thought, where I assign meaning to things based on my social interactions. And as time passed by, with all the stress I had because of my academics, I looked for a partner to lean on, to be my inspiration, and to be my shoulder to cry on. Our relationship actually started last May 2022, where we both have shared common interests. At first, it was kind of an awkward situation where we shared our peripheral items such as age, gender, and even our own location. But as the relationship moves forward, we tend to share our core information, including our goals, ideas, and aspirations. We are now stepping into our 10th month relationship now, and butterflies are still there. With that said, information reciprocation is needed in social penetration theory in order to build and maintain relationships. These theories are in fact fundamentally important. This is to assess what were the communication theories that produced and its effect on my life experience and to my dear diary.